Hello and welcome to Tech Me Out. Today we're going to be taking a look at a tweak in Cydia that was just released today known as Jelly Lock 7. Now some of you may be familiar with it when it was released for iOS 6 because basically what it does is it allows you to quickly launch into your applications from your lock screen. So as you can see, it has this beautiful little rainbow effect here where you can just simply slide this circle over any of these icons and jump straight into the app. So for instance, if I wanted to go into my music, I can slide it over that one and it'll take me straight into, I'm sorry, into my clock. It'll take me straight into my clock app. So I'm gonna just jump back to the lock screen here. So jumping back into my lock screen, like I said, it'll take me here to unlock it or any of these applications to quickly launch them right from my lock screen without even having to unlock my device. So I'm gonna go ahead and unlock it and hop into my settings here. Now Jelly Lock 7 has a few options. One, you can turn the tweak off or on. You will have to respring your device for any of the changes you make within it to take effect. And then to customize which applications appear where, you would do that from within this area here that says App Shortcuts. So up here at the top, it just makes mention of where the applications are in reference to your shortcut selections over here. So the shortcut number one starts from the left, shortcut number two is above that on down to shortcut number five, which is gonna be all the way on the right side of your device. So say for instance, you have a passcode on your device, then you can select for it to override that passcode lock option if you're gonna choose an app from the Jelly Lock lock screen. Um, then you also have the option to hide the camera icon, so that will not be viewable on your lock screen either. And then the last option you have down here is to customize the appearance. So I'm gonna click on that. So from within here, the options at the top you have are to show the badges. So if you get a notification on your messages app and that happens to be on Jelly Lock, then um, you can have it disable or enable the badges appearing on the Jelly Lock lock screen for that app. You can also adjust the setting for a blurred background um, and also some settings for the iPad. Then you can adjust the color of the circle. So for instance, I'm just gonna change bonds to red for demonstration purposes. And I'm also gonna make my circle size very small. And I'm gonna bring my opacity down to about halfway here. So like I said, you do have to respring for these changes to take effect. So I'm gonna go ahead and respring now. And here we are. So my circle here is much, much smaller than originally was. In addition to it being smaller, the icons are also dimmer. So you cannot see them as well as you could before. So that's really it for Jelly Lock 7. Like I said, it is free. I don't know if I said it actually, but that does sum everything up. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Definitely check this uh, tweak out in the Cydia store. It is called Jelly Lock 7. Drop down below what you think of it, along with any other questions or comments you may have for me. Don't forget to thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it, as I'm greatly appreciative of the support. And as always, thanks for taking the time out to let me tech you out.